Good afternoon, everyone. Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com. We're doing that. We finally filled that one up. Jaspies six box, sweet spot, baseball mixer, random team break number one from jazbeescasebreaks.com. A very big thank you to all of these lovely people for getting into the action. Thank you. All teams are in. Let's roll the dice. Let's randomize each list. Two and a six eight times. Two, three, five, six, seven, and eighth and final time. There you go. Two and a six. After eight times, we've got Greg down to John Parsons. And eight times for the teams. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eighth and final time. After eight times, we've got the Tribe down to the Rays. All right. So, Greg, you got the Indians. David Bruins with the Diamondbacks. Paul Hutchins, you got my Dodgers. Art, am I wearing my Dodgers? There you go. The Dodgers. Arthur Hackett, Oppo Joe Mojo, gets the Giants. Ryan Redman with the Cubs. Uh, Richard Warden with the Orioles. Blake, you got the Astros. Tim with the Royals. Scott with the Rangers. Adrian with the Phillies. Brandon, you got the Angels. Joe Foster with the Nats. TJ with the Marlins. David Bruins with the Reds. Big Boys 007 Cardinals. Chris Ensworth, you have the Pirates. Big Boys 007 Mets. Jeremy Miller with the Red Sox. Dave, you got the White Sox. Blake with the Braves. Carlos with the Rocks. You can see the rest right there. Michael Hurd, Brewers, Alex, Twins, Kip Kip, Hooray, Last Spot Mojo, Tigers, John Parsons, Blue Jays, Brad, you got the A's, Chris Yates with the Padres, Elijah with the Mariners, David Bruins with the Yankees, and John Parsons with the Tampa Bay Rays. All right, let's order these numerically, or numerically, alphabetically. Let's put them in order. All right, so any trades? No trades? I don't think there's going to be any trades, right? All right, let's close up that trade window. Trade window closed. Let's print. And let's rip. Is the final printout right there? Let's get with the Tigers. Last spot, Mojo. Uh, Rex is here. What's up, Rex? Rex is saying if Ryan Redman wants to, he said Rex will buy the Cubs outright. If that happens, though, Rex, we'll still send it. We stopped sending it to Ryan Redman, and then you guys can exchange the cards for whatever fee you agree upon. We can't be the middle middleman in this. All right. Uh, let's start with 2015. Let's go from past, I guess, to present, kind of-ish. We're going to close out with Clearly Authentic. But let's go with a slightly uh, older box first. 2015, uh, Brendan Rogers, Dansby Swanson in the mix. There it is. One autograph per box. Good luck, everyone. It's, it's not a it's not a matter of that, Rex. We wouldn't do it for anybody. K 
can't be the middleman. Other people before you have already ruined that. <laughs> ruined that process. No good deed goes unpunished, Rex. All right, seal curtain. Yeah, we'll... Okay, we'll open it. I think Nick Jaspi will be starting off the NT festivities earlier tomorrow. So I, it actually will, might be him opening, popping it open. All right, good luck, everybody. I forget, I think it, it had to be this year. There was, I think, was it Bowman Baseball? Or it was Bowman Baseball or Bowman Draft where Dansby Swanson was traded to the Braves like the day of this release of one of, of, one of these things. So it was, uh, it was kind of a wild day. And then everyone was asking, oh, so does he go to the Braves now? And we're like, no. It still goes to the Diamondbacks. Ah, oh, Mark. What's going on? Mark's asking who I got this week in the Players' Championship in the golf. I went with, uh, with five top five plays. I went with Patrick Cantlay. Cantlay. Plus 700. Sergio Garcia, plus 700. Matt Kuscher plus 800, Paul Casey plus 800, and Heinrich Stenson, sort of a longer shot at plus 1,000. So, yeah, top five, top five picks there. Just a couple of those guys getting the top five, I'll be profiting. Not, not enough value on some of the favorites. All right. All right, all right, all right, all right. Good luck. I have got these inserts right here. Draft dividends. And, and there's Dansby Swanson. Look at that. So yeah, that's still Diamondbacks edition of Dansby Swanson. David Bruins with that one. So there you go. He might have. He might have a David. He might have an interesting season this year. I felt like. I, I feel like. Uh, injuries kind of derailed him last year, you know. But I think he might be might be pretty close to making something happen for the tribe. Eleven out of twenty-five. Ki Tom, 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 Rook <laughs> it goes to the Indians. Greg with the tribe. There you go, Greg. I like the way those oranges look in these sets. Good start to David Bruins, indeed. We got Lucas Herbert. Different parallel, though. That will ship. Not numbered, though. I think there's only one auto per box on that, right? So that's yours. Nice Kevin Newman, gold. Two out of 50, gold paper. And what's the haps? Ian Hab, is that numbered? No, I, th I thought it was. I thought it might be. It's not. It'll still ship. It's kind of interesting because, you know, some of these players, you might start... They might start to uh, be uh, guys that are creeping into the majors. Nice die cut there. I'll save that.
All right, the next little bit here. Save one of those Aaron Judges as well. I've heard of that guy. For a second, I was like, that kind of looks like Aaron Judge. We'll send that to you, Yankees. David Bruins with the Yankees. Got randomized to the Yanks, too. There you go. Just paper, but it's Aaron Judge. All right, next box. Let's, I might as well do optics right in front of me. Um, two autographs per box on average on that one. A lot of different parallels, too. Oh, I guess there could be a hot box in here, too. All right, good luck. Now, going back to the golf really quick. Players' Championship this weekend. I was watching a little bit on the golf channel, early round stuff. Mark is saying that it's a, it's a, favorite, a favorites heavy tournament. Guys like Kusher and Garcia are previous winners. You like them in the top five. Nice. I got those guys. I'm hoping so too. Um, it really took the. Uh, it makes it makes sense when you when you say it, but I, I guess I don't really bet on golf too often. I didn't really think of it, but it does make sense that previous winners of a particular tournament on a particular course, it's likely that 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 they'll do well on those on, in that type of environment. That's what Mark said. He's like, hey. Guys that win previous times, chances are, you know, they'll they'll do they'll do well in those in, pre, in subsequent tournaments. So, I looked at the last uh, <laughs> looked at like the last three years. Look at it. Although I think they changed the uh, see, there's so much research. I think they changed the months. I think it's usually a June tournament or a May tournament or something like that, right? Isn't it? And now they're doing it in early March. Which could affect weather conditions, I suppose. But right, John John Raposo saying your pick is Justin Thomas. I don't know if Justin Thomas had too much too much value, at least for me, to do top five. I don't think the odds were great enough. Yeah, Mark's, yeah, guys Guys play typically play well the same courses each year, which is why Tiger and Freddie Couples always compete at Augusta, etc. I, I don't know. The the so-called golf experts, Mark, were saying that, that there was a difference. It could be the ground could be a little soggier, a little more precipitation perhaps. We've got back to the future, one out of ten, Mark Race. Wow. One out of ten, Mark Grace. Nice one for the Cubs, Ryan Redmond. Right, and wind too. There could be wind at that golf course. We've got a Josh Donaldson. Ah, MVP parallel. A little variation there. Yeah, I was wondering if you were going to be going there, Mark. Mark said he might fly down there for for Sunday for the final round. Carlos Correa to 99. There is 44 out of 75. Max Kepler. That's two autographs. Is this going to be a hot box? Nice Kepler for the Twins. Alex Carmichael with the Twinkies. Nice on-card rated rookie autograph to 75. Another Max Kepler to 99. Images of 
Nolan Arenado to 299. That goes to uh, Carlos and the Rockies. And there's Jonathan Lucroy right there. And there you go, nice box of optic. Set that aside right there. All right, now let's get into some Topps Chrome Baseball. Another two autographs coming up. It's a solid baseball break for the for the price. Ah, Mark saying the the chef at your course is working down there for the week. You just go and chill. You know, I've never been to never been to a golf thing. I've never been to. I've, I've been to like. I've been to like tennis matches. Those are pretty fun to watch. But I have not watched the golf. Like live. I feel like there's a lot of walking. I guess I could sit in like one spot. In like the the grandstand at the last hole or something like that. Ah, oh, that would be cool. Yeah, I'm sure we would love to to head over to the Riviera next year. We'll we'll be in touch. I don't know. Maybe maybe at that point, Mark, Jaspies will be breaking there. Huh? I wouldn't mind that. Hopefully, the weather will be nicer next year. <laughs> Go to the Masters one day? Yeah, I do want to. I, I feel like I missed my chance uh, this year because it was on – I guess it just kind of – it kind of snuck up on me. I was like, oh, yeah. Or no, U.S. Open's in, in on the West Coast this year. Masters, yeah, I definitely want to go to the Masters someday. But I, I was the U.S. Open, I feel like I've missed my chance. I think that's at Pebble Beach this year. And I was like, oh, I should have thought ahead and tried to take like a mini vacay out there and – at the very least, like watch at a bar or something like that. And I love that. I love that area too. The Monterey Bay Aquarium is near there. One of the best aquariums this side of the Mississippi. I'm, that that area is beautiful. I, I enjoy going up there. The Central California coast. It's fantastic. And the beaches are are like pebbles there, just little little rocks. All right. Tops Chrome from whatever this year is. Socrates, re I think it's seventeen, right? Kenta Maeda is on the front. Two thousand sixteen Tops Chrome baseball, with a rookie auto of Socrates Brito for David Bruins. Are there any big golf? There has to be like big golf tournaments in Vegas, right? Should we all go to Vegas for a golf tournament? Would like some some big big names? Redemption, right there. Josh Bruce says, "I've been to the Open four times. It's always worth it." Out of one fifty, George Springer. Should I be? Should I be the guy? Should I be the guy that says, get in the hole? Is that frowned upon? Is that play it out? Seems st still seems kind of fun. Oh, there it is. There's a number right there. Future Stars, Aston Russell, 99. Oh, nice. Shriners open in October in Summerlin. Okay, I know where Summerlin is. That's a nice part of town. All right, 
right, let's see what's what that redemption's all about. Well, I do want to go to the. Uh, I do want to go to St. Andrews. I think that'd be pretty amazing. I can work out a. Uh, Got okay, a, a, a Scot knock out some a Scotland trip and golf and the golf someday. I have to renew my passport. Reminds me, got to do that. You are due to receive a rookie autograph of H E Hen Henry Henry Owens Henry Owens. Was Henry Owens a Red Sox back then in, in the 2016 set? He has to be. In 2016, yes, he was a Boston Red Sox. I feel like this guy has a ton of talent, but just needs to just needs to put it together. All right, now let's get into some Bowman's Best. That Bowman's Best is from 2017, and then we'll do prime cuts, and then we'll close out with that uh, with the encased card and that clearly authentic. Good luck, everybody. So, what is the uh, what is the history of golf? Did it, was it just some dudes in Scotland who were like, "Oh, let's hit this small rock, this small spherical rock with a stick, and try to get in into a certain area in the Scottish Highlands?" Is that pretty much how it happened? Right, good luck everybody. So we got Correa and Royce Lewis on the box that year. And Mitchell White will be the first auto. Paul Hutchins with my Dodgers. I think he's been working up the, the prospect ranks for my Dodgers. A lot of depth there. Raking rookies, I think I think Bellinger's gonna have a big year this year. And the next autograph is Dustin Fowler, Yankees. That goes to David Bruins. Gotcha. So Mark is saying, so yeah, pretty much it was yeah, Scott's with rocks and sticks. Most of the early coasts, of course, were along water because that land wasn't as desirable as it wasn't good soil for growing conditions. Oh, that makes sense. Yeah, why would you, yeah, why would you make golf courses in farmable land? That doesn't make sense. We'll do a randomizer on that. PJ Conlon for the Mets. This is the next autograph that goes to Big Boys 007. So the Davids hitting David Harrell, David Bruins. Any 
And we got another PJ Conlon, this time a little refractor version here. Nice. In fact, let's just, no, we'll hold on to those. There might be a randomizer in this prime cuts. Vinny, do you know John, John Oakray? He's up in your hood. Rory knows him too. He's a golf guy as well. All right, folks, second to last box in our six-box sweet spot baseball mixer from jazbeescasebreaks.com. Uh, if you want more baseball, we got Flawless in the store, so check that out. 30 out of 99, Jose Abreu relic. Game more material for the White Sox, Big Boys 007. Oh, you don't know? Just just Rory from Michigan. Gotcha. All right, we've got another one for the White Sox. 45 out of 49, Frank Thomas. Timeline dual relic. And we've got, I love this stuff. Look at that. Griffey Steele's show. Nice bit of silver right there. Three out of five. Ken Griffey Jr. Two color patch. I, t I, told, I told everybody that Prime Cuts is underrated. Game used material in there. Three out of five. Nice. That goes to Elijah and the Seattle Mariners. There you go, Elijah. All aboard the Big Hit Express. Whoop, whoop. Couple more to go. 33 out of 49 for the Tribe. We got Tyler Naquin. Rookie autograph. Nice. All right, and one out of 25, Mark Trumbo for the O's. Nice. So that goes to the Orioles. That'll be for Richard. All right. Last box, 2017, clearly authentic baseball. One encased autograph, acetate autograph card per box. The nice familiar designs. Given the acetate treatment. All right. Good luck, everybody. Last card of the break. It's going to be for... Wow, for the Royals, it's Bo Jackson. 45 out of 70. Ooh. Ooh. And that old, it's old mid 80s design, I think. All right? 84, 85, 86, around there, somewhere around there. Nice Bo Jackson. Who's got the Royals? That's Tim Smith with the Royals. There you go, Tim. Got randomized the Royals in this break. Very nice. There you have it, folks. What a break. We'll do left-right randomizers on these real quick. We'll do that four times. Four and a one, five times. One, two, three, 
four, and a one. Five times. Right side will get those cards. Right side's right there. And there you go, ladies and gentlemen. A nice, sweet baseball break. That was your six-box sweet spot baseball mixer from jazbeescasebreaks.com. Go visit there for more baseball and other stuff. We'll see you next time for the next break. Bye-bye.